When Apple first released the Apple Smart Battery Case for the iPhone 6 and 6S, I just thought to myself, who designed that? Like seriously, have you guys seen it? It looks like a grade school kid strapped with a backpack full of books. Anyway, with my rant out of the way, years later, Apple released a new smart battery case for the iPhone 10 and 10s Max, and this time, it looked much more elegant. So elegant that I decided to purchase one for my battery obsessed needs. Now you're probably thinking to yourself, doesn't the 10s Max already have good battery life? Why yes, yes it does. But for someone like me who travels a lot for work and would often spend early mornings at airports, it was nice to have additional battery life to get me throughout the day. In this video, I wanted to show you how my Apple Smart Battery Case has fared through daily use for one year. Let's take a look. Here's the case itself. As you can see, structurally, it's still in pretty good condition. I've dropped it a couple of times from around knee and waist level height, and it hasn't suffered any damage, albeit it's only been dropped on smooth surfaces like hardwood floors. I'm sure it would be a different story on concrete. I got the Apple Smart Battery Case in black, as you can see here. Apple also offers it in the white and pink sand color configuration for this iPhone generation. I chose the black because I wanted a very stealthy look and I also thought it would hide dirt and scuff marks easier. As far as battery life goes, this battery case roughly doubles my phone usage. On a typical day starting at around 8 to 9 a.m., I'll start at 100% on both the battery and phone case and will drop to around 10 to 15% on the case by itself by 6 p.m. On longer travel days, where I get up at around 4 a.m. and end my days at around 9 p.m., the battery case will be completely depleted and my phone would be at around 50% battery life. This is with moderate usage as I'm listening to music, playing games, checking emails, watching YouTube, and also reading news articles on the go. The use of this battery case has also slowed down the degradation of my iPhone battery. My launch, 10s Max, is coming up to two years this September and the battery life is currently sitting at 96%. That's only 4% degradation in almost 20 months. That's definitely not bad at all. The coating on the case itself has seen better days. On the edges, you can see the silicon layer peeling away from high wear areas when sliding it in and out of your pockets. Honestly, the iPhone XS Max with this case on it is a thick boy. It's quite hefty, and if you're a person who thinks the Max is already heavy, this combination may be too unwieldy for you. Honestly, with this case on, I never use my phone above my face anymore in constant fear of giving myself a black eye. Yes, it's that dangerous. In the end, I wouldn't change a thing about my purchase decision. The additional hours of being able to watch YouTube, read Reddit, check work emails has been well worth the investment. Honestly, even the convenience of not ever having to worry about your battery life is well worth it to me. Thank you all for watching and I hope you enjoyed the content. Please leave a like and subscribe if you did. Thank you and take care.